Hey everybody, Ozzyrela here, and welcome back to Let's Play Fahrenheit. Last time, we met up with Marcus at the cemetery and found out that he uh, found this lady to help us with uh, what's going on. Uh, yeah. Um, what should we go with? Go with that. <clears throat> so, how's that restaurant murder case coming along? We've got a few leads, but no suspects for the moment. There's some troubling elements about this case. We know it probably wasn't premeditated, and it wasn't done for money. What's your theory? Uh, ritual. Several elements match the ammo of a ritual killing, or a mystical trance. The choice of weapon, the killer's cutting himself, the manner in which the victim was stabbed with precise cuts to the heart, all this points to a religious sacrifice. He might be a Satanist or something like Satanist? that. Satanist? Do you oh, think Satanist. there's much chance he'll kill again? Uh, we don't really know. We don't have enough information to determine that right now. He might do it again tomorrow, or we might never hear from him again. I want this nut job behind bars ASAP. Do whatever you have to do. So, what's the plan now? Check the local hospitals to see if they've had any men with knife wounds in. Check okay. with all the psycho wards to see if they've got any ex-patients out on yeah, the I don't streets. I want to go to psycho ward. Who might have been capable of something like this. Okay. Anything else? Nope. Yeah. Book okay. we found under yeah. the table. Garrett left it on your desk. See if you can make anything of it. Okay. Okay. I'll get on all that stuff right away. What are you going to work on? There's something that I need to verify. All right. We're a little... Carla asked me to see what I could find out about the book we found in the diner. It might be able to tell us something about the killer. I inquired in the office, and I ended up in a bookshop specializing in old books run by a guy named Takeo. Takeo? I like how Tyler has, like, his own, like, theme music. It's pretty cool. Like, nobody else, like, no other character in this game has their own, like, you know, like, uh, music. Yo! Hello? Excuse me? <clears throat> oh, oh, I am sorry to cause a wedding on you. Your presence here bring honor to my miserable shop. <laughs> uh, my name is Takyo. Uh, Takyo. Tell me what I can do to make you happy. Happy? Damn. This guy looks just like that old Chinese dude in Gremlins. <laughs> if he offers me a little box with a monster in it, I am gone. Uh, book. I was digging around in my closet and I found this old book. Thought it might be worth something. Ah, unhappy. I am but the washer's well of ignorance. My tiny expertise extend wholly to books I serve. Well, that sucks. Uh. Well, actually, I'm a detective with the NYPD. You, immigration? <laughs> you come like my pet up? All paper store family is legal. You verify it. No just... problem. Okay, 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 calm down. I'm not here to bust you. If you Should probably went with the case you option. Go now. This private property. Yeah, great Would strategy, us, Tyler. Man. Nice work. Can you just take a look at it? You must have seen books like this one before. Ah, oh, many times, yes. I very sad to say, no can be helping you. No can Thanks be helping anyway. you. At least I tried. Oh, no, me no help you. Ah, uh, maybe there is something I can do for you. Okay. One client. Order very rare book. Since this morning, I look for it, but impossible to find. Impossible. You find this book, and I tell you all you want to know. All right, that sounds easy enough. So, what does it look like, this book you want? Ah, easy. It from same collection as this one. Okay. Okay. I ought to be able to handle that. Bring back the sacred diamond of the old sage of the mountain, and he will give you <laughs> the magic what, what talisman. Is this? Oh man. 
What am I, a video game? No. Through your life. Oh, get up the stairs. Okay, uh... Should probably, like, look at this book. The mag under the magnifying glass. De Grutola. Okay. Uh, let's look at Lucas's book. Nothing on that page, I don't think. Nothing on that. Oh wait. There was something. That page. I think right there. No. This page. It's something handwritten in pencil here. To my brother for his 18th birthday, M.K. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Alright, we're done with that. My shoes. A torn piece of paper. Looks like a computer printout of a bunch of numbers. Fell out of the book. Must have been a bookmark. I'll check it out at the office. It sounds good. <coughs> Alright, uh... What was that thing in? De group de group I think there's a thing up there, upstairs. No, go toward it. There you go. What was it? Uh, I don't see it. 1796. What's the color again? White, I think. Alright, go get the book. That should be it. What does he have to say? Huh. Ah, oh, doesn't the eye icon's not showing up anymore. Alright. I think if I remember correctly, he just says uh, if you can't find the book in here, the book doesn't exist. Nothing too important. There you go. Okay, here's your book. Oh, great. Wh you found it. What happened to your Thanks, accent, man? Dude. What do you want to know about that book? Well, I want to know what happened to your accent. Is it just me, or did you lose your accent? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's for the customers. Ah, they love that wise old Japanese master stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I was born in Brooklyn, man. <laughs> I never been no further than Long Island. Boy, the... Hey, I'm more American than you are, man. <laughs> All right, uh, the book. Can you tell me anything about the book? Yes, yeah, nice edition. Leather cover looks like one in the Shakespeare series published by Lamarck and Everett, 1884. Yo, thanks for your help. That's no it. problem. Come by again, okay? That's all you have to tell us? <laughs> Alright. I guess that's it for this place. Oh, cool bonus card. Plus 20. I like it. As far back as I can remember, I've been frightened by small spaces. Whenever I'm in a small, confined place... Alright, I think I'm gonna, like, stop it here and then... I'll show you guys this again. I need to get out right away. Yeah. Alright, so, uh... 
claustrophobia. See you guys later. Well, I had decided okay. not to let my fear control me. I decided well, let me get to try photos, fight it every chance I got. Stop talking. I'm going to stay calm. Everything is going to be fine. All right. I'm going to breathe deeply and walk without stopping until I find the computer terminal. 